In this video, I'm going to try out the new Connection Story Maker app, which is a communications tool designed to help storytelling challenge scientists and others to focus, structure, and strengthen whatever information they are trying to convey. You can read more about the app, the creators, and the concepts behind it by following the link provided in the app to this web page. Okay, so I have loaded the app onto my desktop, and when you open the app, you see a page like this, which explains the purpose of the StoryMaker tool. It is built on something called the WSP model, that is one word, one sentence, and one paragraph. And the model uses the ABT and logline templates, which I'll get to in a moment. So you're prompted to think of a story and then tap Create to begin. I knew that the template that I would have to follow was based on something called the hero's journey, so I picked a story that would fit that storyline. One that I'm familiar with is the story behind the theory of continental drift. So I titled my story, Continents Adrift. To enter the title, uh, you tap on that line, and by tapping on the space below the word title, uh, this opens the keyboard. And I type in the title, Continents Adrift, and then tap the Done bar. Next, we have to come up with a word that sums up the core message of the story. It might be hope, rivalry, sacrifice, and so forth. And I'll just use the word truth, which refers to the pursuit of truth. Uh, there might be better words, but that will serve for this exercise. Next, we select sentence. This is where we describe this story in a single sentence using the three connectors, and, but, and therefore. We get an explanation of what's needed and an, an example. Then when we are ready, we tap the next button. So now I've typed in my sentence describing the continental drift story, and here's what I wrote. In the early 1900s, there was a scientist who thought that the Earth's continents were once stuck together and proposed a theory that the continents had drifted apart. But other scientists vehemently criticized his idea, which lacked evidence of a force that would move continents. Therefore, it wasn't until geophysical studies revealed the existence of plate tectonics that, along with other convincing evidence, led to the general acceptance of the theory of continental drift. So far, so good. Now we have to write the paragraph, which is based on a template called a log line. And there are nine elements or steps which are derived from a storyline called The Hero's Journey. And there is an example based on the movie Star Wars that you can take a look at on your own. But we're going to jump right into mine. So here you see the nine steps. The first one starts out in an ordinary world. And so we tap the next button so we can type in what the situation was in that ordinary time and place. For my story, I wrote, geologists once thought that the Earth's continents were fixed in their current positions and had never moved. When finished, we go to the next step, which describes a flawed protagonist. If you don't know what a protagonist is, this is the leading character in your story. So here I describe him. In the early 1900s, there was a meteorologist and polar researcher by the name of Alfred Wegener, who gets his life upended when, and next we must describe a catalytic event. Uh, this is an event that starts the hero on his path. And so I wrote, who became intrigued with observation that the outlines of continents on opposite sides of the ocean matched like pieces of a jigsaw puzzle. On the next page, we see the next step, taking stock. And so I wrote, after finding matching rock formations and fossils along the coasts of Africa and South America, and we tap next, the hero commits to an action which is, Wegener proposed a theory that the continents were once stuck together in one large landmass, but later drifted apart. But then the stakes get raised. 
and so I wrote. But when other scientists vehemently criticize his theory on the basis that it lacks a force that would cause continental movement, Wegener's ideas fail to be accepted by the scientific community, which must have been quite a disappointment. In the next step, the hero must learn the lesson. So here's my rendition of the lesson learned. Wegener and other supporters of the theory, called drifters, could not convince the critics of the theory, called fixists, based on observations alone, and needed to show a mechanism to explain how the continents moved. The next step explains how the antagonist is stopped. An antagonist is someone who opposes the hero. Here I wrote, in order to sil silence the critics, more studies were undertaken by proponents of the theory that would provide the necessary evidence. The final step describes how the hero can achieve his goal. Unfortunately, this took quite a bit longer than expected, and Wegener died before that evidence could be uncovered. So I wrote, so eventually, long after Wegener's death, geophysicists uncovered evidence that led to the theory of plate tectonics, which provided the missing mechanism to explain continental drift. We tap finish, and the entire story appears as one long paragraph. If we tap done, we are taken back to the summary of what we've written. And here we have the option of editing any of these parts by tapping the pencil icon. So, what do I think of this app? Well, I can see that it may help those who are not good at storytelling to learn how to better frame their science messages in a way that appeals to people. But I see some issues with trying to fit a science message into a standard storyline such as the hero's journey. There may be simpler and shorter ways to turn a science message into a story that people are interested in hearing. But for now, this gives you a, an overview of how this app works.